Joanna Scanlon is here from After Love, nominated leading actress. Joanna, that must be so exciting. Yes, yeah, it's it's overwhelming and it, and um, it's a bit it, it's hard to compute. You know, it's not something I'd expected at all. Really? No, really, really. Really? Really, really. Not even in the back of your really? mind, just a little like maybe no. this, maybe this. No. Really, no, Joanna? No. Okay, I'll believe it. I know you're Lying a very humble in the person. Water in in the sea in France. This was not something I could have ever imagined. <laughs> But if you had known when you were lying in that freezing cold sea, it might have made it a bit more bearable. No, I enjoyed every moment of that. I love oh, you, cold you like, water. Do you? Yeah, love oh, really? Water. Do you like? Yeah. Are you one of those people who does wild swimming? Yes, I was an early adopter. Yeah, oh, yeah, really? Yeah. Okay. What you don't call it wild swimming then? You just call no, it swimming. No, it was then sort of called wild swimming. Yeah. Um, yeah. Good for you. I mean, I can give you a whole interview about wild swimming. If to you, be honest, I've talked a lot like. about films, Joanna. <laughs> and you know, you've Should seen we... one, you've seen them all, <laughs> beginning, middle, and end. Let's move on to sport. <laughs> yeah. Can I just say? Did you watch the Winter Olympics? No, sorry, I'm, sorry, I've got to be more disciplined. <laughs> sure, I'm sorry. Um, After Love, what an amazing film. What Thank an amazing you. film. Thank you very and, much. And, I mean, uh, the, the script is beautiful. It feels, it feels very pertinent. It feels very relevant to the world we're living in now. What drew you to the script originally? Oh, it's really well written and it's like nothing else. I don't think most people would have seen the combination of characters and situations ever before. I mean, set in... Dover and Calais. Yeah. Um, it's about a woman who's a, a, a white woman who's converted to Islam and, and finds a horror story when her husband dies on yeah. the other side of the water. I mean, those are the things you just don't see together no. very often. And stories that I feel like we want to hear as well. I think there's something about often hearing the same old stories over and over again, hearing something different, something interesting. Yeah. I think it's really what film does so brilliantly, isn't it? Yeah, and it's, a, it's an emotional film. It's a film that, um, that's what I found in the script. It's In some ways, it's beguilingly simple, but in another way, the impact, the emotional impact is really yeah. high. But I think that's something you've done in everything you, I see you in, whether well, there's something like Getting On, which I'm a big long-term fan of for lots of reasons, um, always characters who don't often get, don't often get uh, portrayed, but who yeah. you bring to life so magically and so such humanity. I'm really interested in the way in which some people are considered important and yes. some people are not. Yes, yeah, and yeah. And why is that? Yeah. Um, and how horrible it is when someone puts you down or makes you feel like... You don't matter. Yeah. Um, yeah. And I, I, I've often played characters who are in that category, or have to try to, you know, you know, fight a little bit yeah. Yeah. Uh, for some kind of attention in the world, yeah. or to be heard. Yeah. And that's, yeah, and that's very true of this story. For it's sure. a story of a woman who's ordinarily overlooked. Yeah. Well, it's a beautiful piece of storytelling, and it's a wonderful performance from you. And congratulations, it's so well deserved. Enjoy the ceremony. You deserve it. Thank you, you ever so much. Lovely Thank to see you, Joanna. Thank you so much. Lovely to see you too.